Wet film thickness, or WFT, is a painting industry term that is often used to measure the thickness of wet paint during the application process. It is measured by a simple device called a wet film thickness gauge. Along the edge are a series of evenly spaced teeth. The two teeth at either end are the same length, but the middle teeth are in descending lengths so that when the edge of the gauge is pressed into the wet coating, the thickness can be measured by observing which tooth has wet paint on it. The shorter the tooth, the thicker the coating. The longer the tooth, the thinner the coating. Press into the wet film as soon as it is applied. You will find that the endpoints will always be wetted as well as one or more of the teeth in between. The wet film thickness is determined between the last wetted step and the next adjacent dryer step. Press the gauge onto the test paper. After the gauge is removed from the paint, read the mills of the largest tooth that made an impression and the smallest tooth that did not make an impression. In conclusion, if you have a paint that has a volume of solids of 50%, then a wet film thickness of 4 mils will give you a dry film thickness, or DFT, of 2 mils. An interesting tip. A piece of computer paper is about a DFT of 4 mils. If you're choosing a floor paint that's going to be walked on versus a ceiling or a wall paint, you should get a very high quality paint that resists chipping or peeling. For more information on painting versus polishing, look for our free downloadable ebook on our website, Commercial and Industrial Considerations for Painting versus Polishing, at TitusRestoration.com.